Hi y'all, it's Beth here. Happy Saturday. So today I'm doing a what I melted this week for the week of August 8th through August 14th. Wait, is that right? No, it's not. Y'all, what in the world? I'm just going to start over. Hi y'all, happy Saturday. Today I am doing a what I melted this week for the week of August 15th through August 21st and I'm so excited also if y'all can hear that my dog is drinking water so yep that is Ripley just having some water anyways let's get into what we're actually supposed to be talking about so this week I have three empties which is not too shabby my empties progress this month has been so slow like I think I only have nine empties for the whole entire month and like four of those are samples. So I really need to start emptying out some products here y'all because the month is almost over. So we literally only have like a week and a half left. Um, this first one is from the Melted Mousse and this is a Scent Shock cup in black raspberry and vanilla. This one is nice, but I don't know what it is. Like I had a while back ago Scentsy's black raspberry and vanilla and like my nose just has a very hard time like picking up those notes in the air for some reason because it was the same with this one from the melted mousse like everyone in my family was like it's so strong like it is choking me out how strong it is but I'm like literally I have to really really search for it and I think it's like just me like I think my nose just has a really hard time picking up the notes of black raspberry and vanilla so this one I wouldn't repurchase again just for that reason but I would say if you like those types of scents pick it up because it is a powerhouse um, according to my family so okay I don't know I think I just have like a mental block to that scent or something Next up from L3 Waxy Wonders, I had a Bitty Betty Loaf in Lemon Mint Leaf Fizzy Soda. Y'all, this scent is so amazing. I literally, it's on like its last hour or so in my house right now. It smells so like refreshing and lemony and amazing. I literally am in love with this scent. Like as a clean scent in the house. My mom tells me it reminds her of the smell of a Clorox wipe. To me, I don't get like that heavy cleaner of like, it smells like a lemon scented Clorox or Lysol wipe to me personally, but that's what my mom associates the scent with, but it's just so amazing and good and refreshing and lemony and I love it. So I definitely would repurchase this one. Um, Whenever I'm repurchasing wax from L3, I will have to rejoin the Facebook page and request for that one when I'm ready to make a new purchase from her because it is so good. And then my last empty is Sensi's Apple Butter Frosting. This is an empty clam and I melted um, the last two cubes of this in my bedroom. This scent is so amazing I love it um, I still have a few more in my stash this one is from November of 2020 so it was getting kind of old that's why the clam is like super yellow but it still smelled fine and everything like that um, but yeah this scent is so amazing I definitely would repurchase it's just like such a nice like sweet with like just a touch of cinnamon but not that much cinnamon like, it's not a heavy, heavy cinnamon, in my opinion. Um, and it just is so good. Like, it makes the whole house smell good. It's just so good. Okay, anyways, that's the best way I know how to describe it. It's long-lasting. It throws so well. Okay, now for the things I used that I didn't empty. Only one of them is a downstairs melt, so I'll talk about that first. This one, y'all, I finally am starting to get back into melting my coffee scents um, every so often, like on the weekend mornings or something like that. Um, this one is L3 Waxy Wonders Espresso Sugar Cookie Royale. This one was very nice. Um, I actually melted it 
I want to say on maybe Monday morning or Tuesday morning um, in my house and my mom and I were both downstairs. I was working on schoolwork. She works from home um, because of the like coronavirus and everything. And so, um, yeah, like pretty much we just were both in separate rooms and I had the one warmer in my room, the other warmer in her room. And I was like, oh, it smells so good. And my mom and I love coffee scents, so I needed to get back into melting coffee scents. Um, next up from l 3 xc Wonders in the bedroom, I melted another shape of lavender chamomile pound cake. And this one is good. It's on the lighter side in terms of, like, scent throw. Um... I prefer my scents to be like super strong, even at night, even in the bedroom. <laughs> um, I like super strong scents. So I think with the other part of this, I'm going to take it to the beach with me. Uh, my mom and I have to go there for a dentist appointment and we're staying for a few days. So I think I'm going to take this with me and finish it there, um, see how it performs there. And because I'm just ready to get it done and out of my stash. so. Yeah, but this one is nice, but I just don't think I would repurchase it because it's very light. Um, okay, next up is Zape's Lavender Soda. Y'all, I melted a cube of this in my bedroom again. It smells so, so good. Um, I love this one. The notes are fresh lavender and citrus fizz. This one smells amazing, um, but it only has two cubes left, so I think I can finish it up this month. Um, and just add it to my list of scents that I would like to repurchase eventually one day. And then, um, last but not least that I have to talk about in this video is Yankee Candles Meadow Showers. And this one I have only three more pieces left, so I think I definitely can finish this one up this month as well. Um, this one I enjoy in the bathroom. I also melted it in the bedroom the other day. Um, that's how I you know, made so much progress on it, I feel like, this week is because of that, but, um, yeah, pretty much, I cannot think because it's so early in the morning, <laughs> um, pretty much, I, like, really like this one for the bedroom, the bathroom, even in the open concept, but I just don't have enough pieces to melt in the open concept and get a good performance, um, I love using these Yankee Candle centerpiece cups. They just, like, are more cost-effective than their little, like, wax melt clams. And also, I get a good throw from these. Like, compared to the candles, I don't get a good throw from those. And I just don't have the patience to chop up a bunch of candles or, like, melt them down and pour them into molds and stuff like that like I just don't have the patience to do that with a bunch of candles so the Yankee Candle centerpieces work fine for me the scent is really nice I definitely would repurchase it and that is everything that I melted this week I hope y'all enjoyed this video I will see you next time and as always make sure you stay positive till then bye